What's going on you guys? It's your boy Caesar. I got another unboxing for you guys and you guys can tell by the thumbnail It is the coca-cola a6. I got the white pair and I got the red pair I do have two things to share with you before I open up, but look at you guys can see the box It looks pretty sick. It's that coca-cola You got the drops and everything and as you guys can see I have this one right here and then I have this purple bag right here that is from A6. Let's see if that could focus in. You guys could see it right there. But I just wanted to let you guys know that this is from A6. So something crazy happened. So two things. The first thing is I ordered the red pair and the white pair, size 11, both of them. I ordered at the same time and I got a confirmation, everything. And then two days later, a6 sends me an email and they said that they had to cancel my white pair and I was like what so I went in there checked it out and then sure enough it was canceled so I went into the A6 I searched the coca-cola and they had the the white they had the A6 the white coca-cola size 11 it was there so I was like why did they cancel my order if they had order still if they still had stock I mean in size 11 so I thought that was very weird so I went again and I ordered it. I got a confirmation number again and this time it went through. But the thing is like I had to wait because I got, I, got I got the red pair and then two days late I had to wait two extra days to get the white pair. So this is the white pair right here. So that's my first complaint. <laughs> my second complaint is the red pair came in. it was boxed up. It was boxed up very nice. It didn't have padding on the inside. But the box, it was like a thick box material. The shipping box I'm talking about, it was taped up. Everything was cool. It, it didn't, you know, box is good, not damaged, not that good stuff. Now, they sent me the white pair in this bag. So it's straight up this shoe box inside this purple, this dark purple bag. And I couldn't believe it. So I wanted to include this part of the video because I do not think they should be shipping out in a bag. Like I did a review about this other company. I'm not even going to mention them, but they shipped out in a bag too. And my box was all chopped up. At least this box looks and it feels like it's still solid. So I don't know how it, you know, it kept its integrity. It didn't mess up. Well, we're about to find out when I open it, but this other company, they straight up sent me a shoe. It was a Jordan 1 Mid and it was, the whole box was chopped up. I had to sell it on GOAT opposed to selling it on StockX and I had to let them know that the box was damaged. You know, the seller needs to know that stuff, they're gonna buy it. Some people don't even care about the boxes. So it's cool that GOAT lets you sell damaged box uh, goods. So that is a tip for you guys if you guys didn't know that, okay. So, like I was saying, it does look like it's in good shape. Let's see. We'll take it out of this purple bag. Oh, no. Okay. I already see something wrong with it. Two things wrong with it. It's not the, it's not the end of the world, but you got a little something here. But this one, like it's carved, it's carved in right there. If you guys could see it right there. Man. See? And then you got a little bit right here. So, you know, the, the funny thing is like, this one, I thought, I thought they made the box to be like aged, right? So let me show you this box. It looks like, you see those like white marks right here? I thought it was like supposed to be aged, but now that I'm looking at this other box, it doesn't really have that. So I don't even think it's supposed to look like that, like aged like that. Okay. So let's finish looking at the box. You do have the Coca-Cola symbol right here in the back. You do have a Coca-Cola bottle. That is what it looks like. That's the skew, the size and all that good stuff. Size 11, like I told you guys. So let's, uh, let's open these up first. These are the red ones that came boxed up nice, right? <laughs> you guys, here we go. Here they are. You can see the Coca-Cola. You can see the A6 sign right there. You can see like the gel. It's cool because it looks like it's like the, the glass, like a, you know, an actual Coca-Cola bottle. So I do like that touch. You do have Coca-Cola insole. Let me remove the laces. So you got Coca-Cola on the insole. This is a nice soft material. These look like real good running shoes. I gotta tell you guys. 
like it does look nice they do have the laces those those nice um laces they got with them those uh what was i gonna i was gonna call them cylinder laces the you know the round laces there you go the round laces and then this one doesn't come with extra laces but this one does have a tag with it right here i have not owned asics in a long time and i'm still contemplating reselling them or not i could uh if i didn't have tax in my state i could make my money back i'd probably break even but i'm going to be losing just a little bit if i sell right now so you guys know the name of the game you could just kind of hold it for a little bit see how it goes and uh it was free shipping on the asics website i just I cannot believe that they said that they ran out and they still had some on the website. I just thought that was crazy. Okay, so let me leave that outside so we can actually compare it in a second. And, well, it's kind of weird because this one looks different. If you guys look at the, at the packing, this one looks different than the other one, right? And this one does say made in Vietnam, which the other one doesn't. So, I don't know, maybe they ran out and they started throwing these in. Oh, man. Huh. I was going to say that they started throwing, you know, in different boxes and different tags and all that stuff. So, here goes the white one. So, a thing about the red and the white, when I went back in there to, to order the white one again, I thought that, I thought that the 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 white was going to be more in demand and i thought i wasn't going to find the white one in there but when i went in there and i noticed the red was the one that was like everybody wanted the red for some reason and the white there were still sizes left so i just kind of thought that was weird i thought it was going to be the other way around and uh let me see those are oh something that i just noticed which is on both of them you see like they got that coca-cola bottle right here at the top and I don't know, now that I'm looking at it, I kind of like the white one better than the red. In hand, I do like the white one. You guys let me know what you think, but I'm kind of digging the white one. So let's compare them. Actually, let me grab the one that doesn't have the all these tags on it so you guys can actually see it. So this is it. You know what? I do got the size 11. I could make some match. <laughs> I could do the what does on here. I don't know how good that would look, but yeah, I could. So here they go, side by side right here. Okay. There goes the front right there. I just like how the white is with the with the red laces. I like that better than the red on red right there. I don't know what it is. Okay, you got the inside right here. But you guys can see it says the Coca-Cola on the outside, and that's the cool thing about it. And other than that, they're like the same exact shoe. It's just different colors. So, you know, if you like one, you're probably going to like the other one. And like I said, this is my size, so it's very tempting. Maybe I'll keep one of them and sell the other one. I'm just not 100% sure. You guys let me know what you think. Would you rock the red? Would you rock the white? You think I should keep them? You think I should resell them? The, the one thing I did want to mention about the resale, so these are 11. For some reason, the size 10 and a half are doing like real good. So it's just crazy that a half size bigger is not doing that good, but the 10 and a half is doing like real nice, like for both of them, both colors. So if I did have, if I ordered the 10 and a half, which maybe I could probably squeeze into, um, it would have been a lot better in the resale game. Like, I want to say they're going for, uh, I want to say like 200. I want to say around 200. Oh, and uh, I don't know if I mentioned it. I don't think I did. Uh, retail is 120 for both of these. And like I did mention, they do have free shipping. I had to pay tax. Tax was $10.50. So it was 130 with 50 cents for each of these. So so it's not that bad so that's why i'm like thinking of keeping it you know 130 is all right for a pair of shoes and these look like nice running shoes man i could play some tennis in these i don't know but uh, if you like this video go ahead and hit that like comment any questions tell me which ones you guys are gonna rock the red or the white Th consider subscribing if you guys like sneaker content and i will see you guys in the next video